ABC 15, keeping you home smart, a new move to fight foreclosures in Arizona. Today, lawmakers will also take up a short sale bill. Yeah, the implications are huge because right now, get this, one in every eight homes on the market is a short sale. Unbelievable. And ABC 15's Jody Heisner is live at the Capitol. Jody, will this bill help homeowners? How does this work? Well, Kirk, what's going to happen is what this bill would do is it would help realtors to stay more on top of what's going on with these new issues as they come up. Now, Treasurer Dean Martin has actually created a short sale task force. They're going to be testifying at today's hearing, and I'm here with Treasurer Martin. Treasurer, why are short sales such an important part to the economic recovery of our state? Well, as we all know, we have too many homes. Uh, you know, we had overbuilding during the housing bubble. And if we can avoid foreclosure, not only is it better for the the homeowner and, and their financial re records and, and history, it's also better for the entire neighborhood because foreclosures depress all the property values and cause housing prices to deflate even further. And how would this bill specifically help? Well, what we found in all of this process is a lot of people have never done a short sale before. They haven't been through it. There's a lot of education, both on the financial institution side, realtor side, consumer side. And education is much better than regulation. And so this provides more education to help streamline the system. What are some of the key issues with short sales right now? Well, the, the biggest issue right now is that just the time involved. We have so many. We estimate 67,000 homes were built during the housing bubble without the population growth to move into them. So we have a lot of excess homes, and so it's overwhelmed the system, both in the, the banking side as well as the realtor side, title company, everyone else. So what's happening is, is if it, people don't get the, all the paperwork completed properly the first time, it gets set aside until they have a chance to get back to it. And we've heard horror stories of taking as much as a year to get a short sale processed. If it doesn't process, quickly, sometimes that homeowner who could have done a short sale, it takes too long, they get too much upside down, it ends up in a foreclosure and that doesn't help anybody. And what are some of the other ways the task force is helping? Well, one of the things, again, is to information, providing what our consumers need. And so we're putting together a website with uh, consumer information as well as professionals in the industry information, best tips, tricks, practices, samples. We've been working with the, the federal government. FHA loans are one of the most popular loans here in the Valley. And we've been working with them. They're about to release some new information uh, here in the next few weeks. All right. Thank you so much, Treasurer. And that hearing getting underway today at 2 p.m. And we'll make sure we get the Treasurer's website up as soon as that's up and running. Live at the State Capitol, Jody Heisner, ABC 15 News.